Hello, everybody. Avery's supposed to say hi. Honey, what's sleeping? You. I have the seatbelt on. No, you don't. I don't. You don't have your. He don't have his seatbelt on. So everybody, hi. Uh, what are we doing today? Ooh. We're um going to. We're gonna try to go to Back to America's Best and try to get these glasses. Um. And then I just feel salty when I think about this place now. But then we'll get Michael new glasses. See how that works out. And then I think we're gonna go to DeKalb's Farmers Market, which my husband informed me they don't like you to videotape in there. So I don't know if I'm gonna get a video in there or not. And it's cold in Atlanta. It's just cold. I don't know what the hell. It's almost like Mother Nature is making us work for some warmth. And this is this is just not cool. It's cold down here. But I know it's colder other places, so I really shouldn't complain, but it's cold in Atlanta. I ain't gonna lie. Um, can't wait for spring. We got a couple more weeks left before spring will be here. And uh, I don't know. Where's the butler? Too cold. Yeah, so no, that's it. So we're gonna go get these glasses, go to the farmer's market. Um, what we're going to the farmer's market for really is we are all, all out, out of um, spices to season our food with. Um, I don't like to use salt. really don't like to use the Lowry season salt. I like the homemade. I, I like the, the, the spices and stuff that's at the farmer's market. That's why I'm really going over there. I haven't been over there in a long time. Like, it's been a minute. So, we're going to get some. And it's cheaper to get your seasoning and stuff from the farmer's market. Anyway, at the Cavs Farmer's Market, it's just cheaper to get them there. Um, yeah, so that's it. And we'll see if we have enough time to maybe hit up some lunch or something. In a quarter mile. Okay, so I'm back. So these are the one of the pair of glasses that I brought. These um these glasses from America's Best. I wanted to get away from like the black. So these frames are like they're Darion Darion frames. Okay. How about the other glasses that I got? I put them on, they were like a small, like a brownish, burgundy type color frame. Put them on, and I'm like, something doesn't feel right. I have blurriness on both sides. The guy goes, those frames are too small for your face. And I said, why would your staff member fit me for some frames that are too small for my face? So I guess once you put the actual lenses in, so now I have to come back in another week or so to get the second pair of glasses, and they're not even a color that I wanted. And of course, because I always wear black frames, he tried to put me back in black, and I was like, no. So these are like, I don't know, they'll be okay. But I don't know, what do you guys think? I think these are cute. My goddaughter picked these out. These are like a, to me, like a nerd frame you think i mean that's the thing yeah no, i don't think they're nerd frames you don't think they're nerd frames no. are you sure yeah my husband doesn't think they're nerd frames but um i like them they're cute i think they're cute so that's that for that so yeah this america's best in duluth i will definitely probably i can almost guarantee that I won't be coming back to this store again after I get these second set of glasses because I don't like you know stuff like that and then they're gonna say Saturday um, that their clock must be a little bit fast so the alarm once the alarm goes off they can't let nobody in lies they tell but anyway I don't care whatever but so I gotta wait another week to get my second pair of frames from them so but that's okay I have these and I'll rock these. Um, they're okay. I think I think I like them. If I don't, if I, when I get home and if I don't like them, they'll be staying in the house. And my husband's like, oh, you paid money for those. They shouldn't stay in the house. But if I don't like a pair of glasses, I don't wear them. But I think these are cute, though. So we'll see. Hun, really? Excuse me. I gotta turn around. We're trying to find this event hall right, down that, block. that he um he is going to be videoing, video, video, videoing a wedding in June and we were in the neighborhood so we're going to go check out the event hall well, if they let us check it out um, we're going to go check that out and see how their lighting setup and stuff is there um, so yes yeah, for a friend of mine that um, she's getting married in June and so my husband here 
and his cousin is going to be doing her wedding. So, yeah. And then I guess we'll head over to the other side of town. And yeah. Alright, so we're here at the Caps Farmers Market. We're getting ready to go in and see what we could find in here. But like I said, I came here mostly to um, get me some spices and some seasonings. And I'll probably get my kids some fruit or something. And then they also, they also even though, yeah, they have an awesome bakery in here. But I just want to give me a couple of things. I haven't been here in a while. I'm going to try to record in here a little bit. But they don't like you to record in this farmer's market for some reason. So, um, if not, then I will be back in the next segment. So, we're back from the, um, out of the farmer's market. And so, um, I don't know. I at first I wanted to get me some wings because the wings are the best over here, like in Stone Mountain. But baby was hungry, so we ended up getting um, some Burger King instead. So I got him a kid's meal. He doesn't eat his fries, so I'm gonna eat them. They go. Is it good? And I gotta go to the gym later, but it, oh my god, it is so cold on this side of town. Like, it's cold here, period, but this wind is nothing to mess around with down here today. Um, god, the wind cuts right through you, and I had the nerve to be, um, people are gonna probably laugh, but it's like trying to snow over here, like flurries. Um, it's cold, I don't know. Once I get, get to my house, I'm not coming back out today. So right now we're at Kroger. And, um, am I, <laughs> people are looking at me black. <laughs> we're at Kroger and we're filling up on, um, gas tank. I'm filling my gas tank up. And, um, they have, like, the pink gas attendants. They're, like, wearing, I mean, the gas attendants, they were, like, they were, like, pink. All right, so we're back. Um... We just had finished getting some, getting the gas, and now we're gonna eat our. He's gonna eat, eat our Burger King. Um, and then let me see. You guys, y'all can see it. It's like snowing, a little snow flurries. Um, and then we're gonna head home. I don't think I'm going outside. Like I said, I don't think we're going back out no more today. I'm not. Anyway, I don't know about him. I think and my husband has a headache today, so. You want some juice? He he ate his burger, but he only he took the burger apart. And so I picked that up. He just ate the meat? Yep, he just ate the meat. He wants his juice, I can't. You want your juice? So we're eating our lunch and um Oh, the, the Cats Farmer's Market. I got some really good deals. I'm going to shoot another video when I get home, probably. I, I don't know if I shoot, if it's going to be if it's gonna be separate or if it's going to be the, um, the same video. But I got some really good deals. I got a lot of spices and stuff. And they were like, and I got a, I got loose tea. I got spices and I got me some loose tea, which I needed. They were all out of the Bragg's um, apple cider vinegar, which I hated because it was like $2.99 for the bottle. And we needed it for... Um, this detox drink that we're going to be making um, in the mornings. Um, so we, I got to go. To, I probably will go. I don't know. I, I do have to go to. We have to go to Kroger. Or we got to go somewhere. Unless you just want to do it tomorrow. I don't know. Anyway, I don't know if I'm getting it today. But I, you know, I got um, all kinds of spices because I got a big old thing of like say lemon pepper for like a dollar something the way they package their stuff and they package their own spices and stuff and i got um my baby some oranges and what else uh got some ground turkey and we got some some chicken legs for like a dollar something a pound um it's got a couple of things here and there well i'm proud of my husband one thing he didn't let me do at the Cats Farmer's Market, I guess when it gets close to date, they'll take like a $18 cheesecake and mark it down to like $8. And I was so tempted to buy my boys a dessert today. 
but I knew I would have. He knew I would have wanted to eat some, so he made me be strong, and we didn't get it. So the next time, maybe, but we didn't get it. So thank you, honey, for not letting me get mm -hmm. that cheesecake. Cause what you don't want to hear it at the end of the week when the yeah, scale don't move. Exactly. So he don't want to hear it when the scale doesn't move at the end of the week. And plus, I body is sore the way I've been working out. That darn scale better move this week. Hopefully it will. I mean, I'm sure it will. But um, even me eating like some fries is fine because I burn up around. I think when I worked out yesterday, I burnt around 600 calories. So that's fine. Sometimes you gotta trick the body. But that concludes our vlog for today. Bye. Say bye, Austin. Say bye. Austin. Austin, say bye. Austin, stop squeezing that. Austin. <laughs>